FMPro Migrator connects to SQL Server databases using an ODBC connection in order to accurately transfer Unicode data. You would need to have already installed the SQL Server or SQL Server Express Edition database software. And you would need to have created a SQL Server database on the server and have the SQL Server service running. FMPro Migrator is a 32-bit application. Therefore, you need to use the 32-bit ODBC administrator to create a new ODBC DSN. DSNs created with one version of the ODBC administrator are not seen by the other one. If you accidentally create a 64-bit ODBC DSN instead of a 32-bit ODBC DSN, you may get an architecture mismatch error. Create a system DSN with the 32-bit ODBC administrator. Click the System DSN tab. Click the Add button. Click the SQL Server ODBC driver. Click the Finish button. Enter a name for the ODBC DSN. This name will need entered into FMPro Migrator. Select the server name from the menu. Click the Next button. Enter a login account and password for the server. Don't select the integrated Windows authentication since FMPro Migrator uses username password logins. This login information is not saved, but it will be used to list the names of the available databases on the next screen. This is also a good way to troubleshoot your login and database connection info which you have entered so far. Click the Next button. Click to select the checkbox to use a default database. Using a default database selection ensures that your data gets written into the correct database. Select a default database name from the menu. Click the Next button. Check the Perform Translation checkbox. This way Unicode data will be transferred correctly. Click the Finish button. Click the Test Data Source button. When the test passes, click the OK button. Your new SQL Server ODBC DSN has been created, tested, and is ready to use.